Hello and welcome to another 007 Gold. Um, this week I'm showing you my um, my display for the James Bond attaché case. As you can see there, that's the Walther PBK. It's a replica, um, 3D printed. And this is, uh, it's just basically a copy of a Rolex uh, watch in the style of um, the one seen in uh, From Russia With Love. Um, these, um, they're not real bullets. <laughs> Uh, there were actually key rings and what I did was took the key ring off and uh, ground down the loop on the back of the bullets so they just look nice for display alongside the uh, alongside the 3d printed gun um, we also have the coins at the back um, which are painted shillings from the 60s uh, this you can see is the spectre ring which is uh, the type worn in from Russia with love by Kronstein um, and then we we'll have uh, a future project to actually fit the uh, sliding knives to the case, which I haven't done yet. You can see these are the type that we used to have as kids. Uh, you can still buy them. They're just all plastic and the blade uh, pushes inside the handle. So uh, there's no damage to anyone. <laughs> it's all safe. Um, this is actually um, something that was used in the movie. Not this exact item, but it's where Bond's checking for bugs in the hotel room in From Russia With Love. Um, and this is one exactly the same as it. It's actually for testing the thickness of paint in the automotive industry. That's what they were for. Um, but I was lucky enough to get my hands on one. Cost about 25 quid on eBay, which was a bargain because they're old now, 60s. Now, one thing this case has that the one used in From Usher With Love doesn't have is a fold down top like this. And it's just where I keep odds and ends. This is um, the exact style of pen, Parker pen that was in Goldeneye with three clicks to explode. Um, here we'll have the, um, this is a copy of the ID badge at the start of Octopussy, where uh, James Bond is impersonating Colonel Toro. And this one is not from any of the movies at all. It's just something I found neat. It's in the name of James Bond, uh, available on Amazon. It's not actually a credit card copy. It's a lock picking set. So <laughs> I just thought it would be a bit of fun and would go nice in the case. Uh, another thing to, Another little thing to display for a bit of fun. Uh, then we have here what we have is two different types of cards that you see in the Daniel Craig films. There's his official um, Secret Intelligence MI6 card and also the Universal Exports uh, cover card um, when he's assuming the identity of uh, a worker at Universal Exports, obviously. Um, next, what we have is this is a, a replica, duplicate of the advertising for the Aston Martin DV5 that was made by Aston Martin. Uh, they used they made that advertising campaign in the 60s and then we'll have three original um, small advertising labels for the Ritz the Savoy and BOEC airplanes and um, aircraft rather uh, from the 60s uh, so that's quite nice I, I picked those up uh, very very cheaply on eBay as well and they're just a nice little addition something you might find in a in an attaché case and um, last but not least we have an actual copy of the Times from 1963 the year that from russia with love was released and you can imagine we know from the books that james bond read the times so he may have had a copy in the attaché case at some point you don't know so i thought it would just be a nice little collectible to pop in as well have a, a 1963 edition of the times in there um so that's basically it it's just a display piece it's obviously not screen accurate it's just a bit of fun um it looks quite canny and it's a good talking point um type of thing I enjoy to do with the collectibles I'll, the, you know collectibles should be displayed thanks very much for watching hope to see you again cheers